Hello everyone, welcome to my Glide Apps Advent Calendar template. As you can see, I have it filled out, but you are welcome to go into the spreadsheet and make it your own. Let's start with the data sheet. I have dates uh, December 1st through December 24th. Some Advent calendars go through the 25th, so feel free to add your own row. I have a text column, which is my label. I have a details column, which is the description for my label of the source where I got my detail. And the image column are the images one through 24, all sourced from Unsplash, which is why I have an image credit column. If it's an image that's your own, feel free to delete the credit column. It won't hurt anything. I also have a picture of open present box, so if the date has passed, then the app will show this opened present box. So if you're looking at the app and it's December 3rd, you'll get the open present box image for the first and second, and you'll still get the numbers for the dates going forward. And then again, I credit the open image. So the only complicated thing at all with this app is simple if-then statement. So let's go over to Glide Apps. So here you can see the example. It's the second, so that means we've opened uh, our advent calendar for the first and the second. But if you click into the details, you still get the number so you don't lose your day. So if we go over here to the data sheet, one important thing if one playing around with the template is to make sure that the day is a date format. When I first started working on this, it was a uh, number or is a text format, so it, it wasn't working right for the formula. But if you make sure it's a date, then you'll be just fine. I added this new column, which is the if then statement. So if we go and look at it, we can see it's an if then. If the day is on or before today, show the open image column, which is that picture of the open present box. Else, show the image, which is the column for the images 1 through 24. So you can see it's, that's the only type of formula for our advent calendar. Now if we go look at the app itself, this is the home page, nothing fancy. If we click, you'll get the image, the number. Here you can see the description, label, the description, and where I source my information. And then I added a copy button, which copies the text of the description. But all this you can play around with. You can't mess it up too bad. <laughs> And you can make it your own. All right, so copy. You can see, I bring up a notepad. The copy paste function works. That's good. And that is the Advent Calendar app. Enjoy.